What's up, everyone? Happy Tuesday. We are back here at the Woodmere Docks, and we are joining the sun as it rises up over the water. Absolutely beautiful morning. Day 113 of the 365-day journey. Look at that. I got to say, I've been blessed with some nice weather in this process. There's only like, I think, three or four really rainy days. And the rest uh, were pretty nice. Some fish jumping over here. Oh, look at them go. See them all jumping? Pretty cool. What's up, Benny? Check out that sunrise. We are up with the sun. Getting it done. All right, all right. So, I don't know if you guys saw last night. We did a our live podcast every Monday night, 8.30. Uh, streamed live on Facebook on my page. And we stream it on the Apex Entourage page. And we call it Get Some Fire with Brian and Sam. And um, we like to bring on a special guest that can add some inspiration to your lives. We try and add some inspiration to your lives. We try and laugh a little bit, have some fun. And brighten up your Monday and start your week off right. And last night we had the one and only Slayer, Jessica Dennehy, on. And we appreciate her for coming on. She, uh, She's awesome. I mean, she just gets it done. No excuses. So, anyway, so let's talk about the uh, message of the day. So, message of the day is the power of manifestation. What do you expect in your life? Do you expect things to happen? Do you will them into your life? Because when you manifest things... And you think about them and you make them come into your life. Um, power of positive thinking. So think about it like this. Um, when a bunch of kids are at a birthday party, right? And the pinata comes out. That pinata is full of all, all the goodies, right? All the candy, all the goodies are in that pinata, right? And each kid walks up expecting to break it open. Expecting to receive um, the riches of their work. And you never know. At what point it's actually going to break and open up. So each round you hit it, you hit it a little bit harder, you hit it a little bit harder, and you keep putting in the work and you keep putting in the work and you keep hitting it and you keep hitting it and you keep hitting it till finally, unexpectedly, it it breaks open and I get attacked by a bee. Uh, it it breaks open and the the riches come out. This guy's trying to attack my phone. All right, the bees are out of control now. I don't know if you. Got the same thing going. Uh, so as I run around chasing the bees, they're everywhere. So anyway, um, so when you're hitting that pinata, when you're a kid hitting that pinata, they don't think it's not going to open. They don't think they're not going to get what they want. They just keep hitting it, and they just keep hitting it, and they just keep hitting it until it opens up. So in our lives as adults, we gave up that drive. We give up too easy. We don't keep hitting it. You know, when 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 life isn't crack it open and we're not getting what we want out of it. We just got to keep hitting it, hit it, hit it, hit it, and keep expecting it to open. You know, no one gives up on a pinata. When was the last time you saw a bunch of kids at a birthday party give up on a pinata? They just keep hitting it and they hit it and they hit it and they hit it and they don't give up until it opens. And then when it opens, boom, it all comes at once. So uh, I thought that was a good analogy for uh, manifestation, manifestation. So we just got to keep believing. We just got to keep expecting that it's coming. Because if you say, oh, one day this will happen one day. No, I want it to happen today. And I'm going to hit that pinata as hard as I can every day until it opens up. No one day it's going to happen sometime in the future, maybe tomorrow. No, today. Today we're going to hit that pinata as hard as we can. And we're going to expect it to open. And maybe it will open today. Maybe it will open tomorrow. But we won't know unless we hit it as hard as we can every day. So that's your message of the day. Expect things to happen in your life. Expect the pinata to break today. Expect things to open up today. Expect the riches to come today. And just keep hitting it because you never know when it's going to break open for you. And never give up. All right. There's your message. Um, let's jump into prayers. we got some great scenery for our prayers today. Look at this sunrise over here. Look at the sunrise. we got the marina here. So this is Woodmere Docks. This is I'm get hit by this bee over here again. Golf course over here. Wow, this is crazy. Um, New York City is up in that direction, about 20 miles. And we got the sun over here. All right, so let's let's pray over here before the bees attack me. Dear Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, please help us to have faith. Please help us to never stop believing. Please help us to have expectancy, to be confident that things are going to happen for us if we just keep doing the work. We just keep hitting that pinata. Please help us to be grateful for every level we've got to, for the opportunity to keep hitting that pinata, the opportunity to be out of bed every day, the opportunity to see the sun every morning, and just that we just remain faithful and remain confident and uh, remain positive. Amen. All right. So we're going to get on with our day today. Uh, let's see. I got to meet an appraiser at 930 on uh, my Wag Avenue property. That one is now in contract and moving on its way. Uh, contract should be signed on my Oceanside property. Uh, accepted offer on that one. It's half signed. That should be going. Uh, we're going to do an open house this weekend over in Rockville Center on the co-op. I had someone I thought was going to buy it, but uh, they're stumbling. So now we're going to do an open house on that. So anyone looking for that, Rockville Center, one-bedroom co-op, one Jefferson Great location, 259. Maintenance is only 714. Again, if you're renting an apartment right now for two grand a month, you could own this for less than that. So uh, talk to me. Uh, what else we got going on? Uh, a couple others are getting ready to close. And I uh, got a couple closings coming up in the next couple of weeks. And uh, a couple of things potentially coming to the market. Uh, a couple of people trying to decide what they want to do. But the market is busy. Um, seems like once uh, not the summer's over, the people are back. It slowed down a little bit in August. But uh, from the last couple open houses, um, the traffic's up. People are out buying houses still. So uh, as much as we thought maybe it was slowing down, seems like that might have been just the uh, summer uh, vacation season. So if you're thinking of selling, let's talk. Let's talk. I got buyers. I got a lot of people looking for houses and still not much inventory. So. All right, everyone. Have a great day. Keep hitting the pinata. Hit it as hard as you can every day. You never know when that pinata is going to break open for you. Keep hitting it. All right, everyone. God bless. Have a great day. Go check out my page. We write at Thorn 365 uh, Facebook groups. Uh, search that in the search bar. We write at Thorn 365, all one word. Jump on there. I had some inspiration every day. Um, in addition to this, I invite your friends. Share this message. We're going to try and change the world together. We're going to make everyone's lives better. All right, everyone, God bless. Have a great day.